Hillsborough deputies have chased a lot of suspects, but they weren't expecting this right here, a zebra on the run. And before it was over, that zebra charged at one homeowner and smashed into a truck. ABC Action News reporter Ryan Smith is live in Bomb, where the zebra escaped a gated compound there, Ryan. Jameson, that's right. The animal's owner here keeps dozens of captive wildlife on the property, including several zebras. And now an investigation is underway here to determine how exactly this zebra managed to escape out of this gated compound. And that's why I kept telling myself there is no way there's a zebra in my backyard. Mark Ross thought it was all in his head hallucinating. So I was sitting here taking steals and then I was taking video all the way across to the point where uh, I could get something that uh, to prove that I wasn't crazy. He wasn't crazy, but this afternoon's slow speed chase through southern Hillsborough County certainly was. As the helicopter was up there going crazy and when there's something like that, there's either a robbery, there's a terrible accident, or there's a felon loose or something happened. But you never thought it'd be a zebra. I never thought it would be a zebra down the road. Animal owner Jennifer Cottill isn't saying how the zebra got out. Workers on the property today did not want to comment. Florida Fish and Wildlife says the owner is certified to house captive wildlife and recently passed an on-site inspection. While the FWC investigates what exactly happened. Came back and forth probably about 20, 25 times. Neighbors can laugh about a once in a lifetime encounter. I don't think he was trying to run over me, but you couldn't tell because I mean, you can hear the hooves and he, I got out of the way. He ran that way and I got my phone out. The zebra did smash into a moving truck today nearby during this chase. That driver did suffer some minor cuts due to some broken glass, but is expected to be okay. Live in Hillsborough County tonight, Ryan Smith, ABC Action News.